guys, welcome back. It is Tara with Sustainable Hanger and we are going to talk clothes today in this video because there are fails <laughs> to experience. Today's outfits, although I did it, I want it to be dedicated to this process because I know that there are certain times that you go out and you see something, you love it, and just like with any other shopping experience, you get it home and it's not what you thought. Um, these were my selections for this two dollars used day albeit i wanted to change halfway but i thought that i would carry along carry you along uh, this particular part of the journey so, so it is purple green white and a turtleneck black so you know pretty basic palette um just a lot of fun a little bit of funk um and so that was that the thing about this top is that it billows around the middle section and my proportions are such that my waist is smaller in proportion to my hips and my bust. So probably not the most flattering. So that's why this one kind of gets a thumbs down for me. And the second look with this, I basically have the same palette. This one is a little bit more business casual office appropriate I have a blazer that you know you can slide over so that you're not bearing your back to your co-workers I didn't want to put it on because it just wasn't flowing the right way like the proportions there were too many lengths the jacket was hitting at the hip the shirt wasn't really tucked in so it just was it was bad so I ended up just you know kind of giving a visual effect by toting it along as you see here <laughs> All right, let's dive into this thigh high <laughs> gray tunic that I misled for a dress. I don't know if it was just in the moment and I was like, ooh, ribbed, cotton, gray. Yes, well, not so much anymore. This thing has the least amount of shape and does not have any snap in it, so it just kind of falls. On. What I ended up doing was trying to figure out ways that I could go in and accentuate my waist, which is the smallest um, in proportion to my body. So here it is with a uh, with a over the knee boot and a moto jacket, and that's all I got. <laughs> Look with that same item. We have the gray tunic paired with a skinny legging, leather-ish, leather-like legging, and a tennis shoe. And this is definitely something that I would wear for an errand. Of course, the waist is an issue again. I then ended up putting a, a denim jacket on top just to see if that would make any difference. And I still kind of felt like meh about it. Finally, I got in the mirror and just started pulling up on that um, split and decided that I would tuck it at the top of my pants. So now it looks a little bit different. It doesn't have that thigh high action. And by doing that, I actually kind of created the illusion of a cinch. And I threw on some mules with it, and I was literally done with this piece by that time. <music> Guys, so that is going to wrap it up for me today. It's never a lose-lose. You can always donate it back <laughs> to someone who might be able to fit it. If you do resell, you can always cart it out that way. or You gain the information that you need to make wiser choices in the future so thank you guys so much for indulging me on this journey today i look forward to seeing you all in the next video follow me on instagram don't forget to like share and subscribe and i'll see you next time thanks for watching